What's up guys, Jimmy or Chaos, and as you saw on the screen, if you guys want to get the ultimate utility app for COD Ghost on your smartphone, be sure to check out the link in the description. Use promo code CHAOS, and you guys, you won't regret it. The thing is awesome. Now, we are bringing back the Super Series. I say bringing back because we haven't done one in probably a month, month and a half. It's crazy. I do these series, and then I realize and look back, I get caught up on other stuff, and I'm like, whoa. I haven't put one of those out in like a month or two months. And I'm like, oh, okay, well, let's get on this and, and get back on track. So today we have the Super MTAR. That is right, the Super MTAR X, whatever you want to call it. And we supersize this thing. And I had a little fun with this. I could have went different ways. The MTAR is a beast without any attachments. We already know that. But I had a little fun with it. And if you don't know what the Super Series is, it's where we take the third attachment perk and we load up with three attachments on a gun and we, we do the best we can to make a super gun. And with the MTAR, it was pretty easy because, like I said, the MTAR is a beast. Everybody knows that. So, I put the muzzle brake on it because the MTAR is like a baby assault rifle anyway. And you put something on it that increases the damage at a distance. Well, that's winning every time, no matter how you look at it. And then if you add the foregrip and you add that accuracy to it, once again, you are getting into the boundaries of having a super MTAR X. But... What really was the kicker for me, and I could have went different ways with this. I could have I could have put different stuff on it, but I decided to go with rapid fire. So I gave back a little bit of that accuracy with the rapid fire, but in return, you I'm telling you, if you're within 10 yards, now I'm not formal, formal TK, one of the guys on my pro team that can um, across map snipe dudes with an MTAR with an SMG. I can't do that. My aim is horrible. But what I can do is if you're within 10 or 15 yards of me, I'm going to kill you. Especially with an MTAR with rapid fire. You have no chance. You'll see I get a lot of hip fire kills here. I should have put on that perk for, for steady aim or whatever it is, the one that, that increases hip fire. I may have. I'm not for sure. But if I didn't, I need to. And this thing absolutely cuts people in half. Demolishes them with the rapid fire. If you haven't tried it, I strongly suggest it just for the lulls because you're going to have fun with it. You don't have as good of accuracy, but it doesn't matter. Because if you're playing a map like this, like Octane, if you're playing Blitz or TDM or something like that, you're going to rush around the map, especially the smaller maps. You are going to dominate these people. They have no chance, even if you're hip firing. You can hip fire ADS. It doesn't matter. This rapid fire is just, it's really not fair being allowed to put this on the MTAR. So... There you have it, the Super MTAR X, part of the Super Series. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Try it out. If you enjoy it, let me know. Shoot me a comment. Shoot me a tweet. Uh, a lot of you interact with me on Twitter. I do my best to reply to as many as I can. My mentions are pretty much constant flowing every day, but a lot of you know if I catch it, I'll try to reply to you guys because why wouldn't I? You guys are taking the time to watch my videos and give me feedback, and I, I definitely appreciate that. So, hope you guys enjoyed be sure to drop a like. Let me know what you want to see next on the Super Series. A lot of people have asked, where is the no one likes this gun? And I think we're going to go back to past CODs because we're pretty much done with Ghost on that. So you give me some suggestions on guns no one likes and past CODs, and we may bring that back as well. I'll see you guys later. <laughs>